this moment, I am headed out to go get a bowl because I dropped the bong last night. Go me. Um, but I'm making this video because that was a terrible shift. Last night, I felt like my entire fucking world got dark again. Meaning, Big Kev comes in, shines his fucking light, makes everything glow with his energy, and life feels fucking great, and like it's positive again, and I can, I could do this fucking rodeo. big head that I cannot see him on the 8th and the 10th. Uh, very proud of myself. That is something I 100% do not want to do. I cannot hear anything come out of big Kev's mouth that is by any chance or means unbecoming of himself. It's fucking monumental in the way he stands in my soul. The way I see him, who he is, how he respects everybody and cares for everybody. He's just an amazing human being to know. So, um, I don't know how much longer I'm going to be in California until the 22nd. I have to be here for my stupid MRI unless I get it pushed up sooner to get my shoulder seen. But I'm not going to let Big Kev go through my hands. Not this time. I will remain ladylike and I will compose myself in a manner that I will be proud of. But what I'm not going to miss is the opportunity to just fucking bask in his glow. I'm gonna go down there and I'm gonna see him, but I will most definitely keep boundaries.